This video is going to show how the intro application is going to make intros the easiest part of your day. It can really be a pain to go back and forth through emails, wasting time by trying to keep track of everything, and this is a wonderful and professional solution. This is a Chrome application and there are details in the description on how to add it as an extension. Let's take a look at how the process works. When you're in Google, you're going to click on your intro tab after you've downloaded the extension and we want to go to make intro and on this first screen you're going to enter the email addresses and the names of the two people you would like to introduce the first person is Jason Taylor who is an entrepreneur in the audio video field and the other party is Paul Simmons who works for a healthcare company in this particular instance Paul is looking for an individual that can edit training videos that he has recorded at his company after the names are entered we're going to activate the on buttons And now we're going to go to next. On this screen, we're going to enter the information to Paul why Jason would be a great fit to edit his company training videos. We're going to inform Paul that Jason has a great background in the audio video field and he can provide a professional touch to enhance your production. And then we're going to go to next. On this screen, we're going to enter the information to Jason about the services that Paul needs at his healthcare company. Paul is looking for an entrepreneur in the audio video field to edit training videos for his healthcare company. So after we've entered this information, we're gonna do next. After you've entered the information on the previous screens, it's gonna populate in the preview screen and you can change anything in here that you need. If you need to change any of the verbiage, you can change that or if you wanna add anything, you can do that as well. And you also have options to select the template to insert, add new template or edit the template. So for this example, we're going to go ahead with the message that we have on the screen here and we're going to send this to both parties. And here's the best part. After the information is sent, Paul, the one who works for the healthcare company, is the first one that's going to receive the message. Jason will not receive anything until Paul confirms that he would like to meet. This is great because Paul might decline the offer and Jason will never know his services were declined. Also, Paul might not respond to the email right away and if he decides to respond several days later, Jason will not be waiting on a response. So let's go ahead and send this information and let's take a look at the email that Paul will receive. All right, so as soon as the message is sent, this is what's gonna be in Paul's inbox. Now let's open the message and this is what he'll see. I'd like to introduce you to Jason Taylor. Paul is looking for an entrepreneur in the audio video field to edit training videos for his healthcare company. And if you'd like to meet, please click the link to confirm. So once Paul hits the connect button, Jason's gonna receive an email indicating that Paul would like to meet. So let's hit the connect button. And after clicking the link, you'll receive this confirmation message. So now let's take a look at Jason's email. And here's the email that's waiting for Jason. After each party has accepted, there will be follow-up emails sent to each party to confirm how things are going. You also have the ability to look at past conversations, which is another great way to keep track of everything. And all you have to do is click the icon under past intros, and you can see the past introductions that you've made. Introducing everybody in one email doesn't give everyone the best chance to communicate. If you were looking for a great way to make introductions between two people, this option will give you the best results. Click on the intro link in the description to add this to your Chrome browser and thanks for watching.